So today I wanted to talk about debating. How everybody doing out there? I know it's been a while since I've uh, been on YouTube, but I'm about to start doing this um, real uh, steady now, consistent. And I just wanted to get these thoughts out right now while I was um, thinking about it. So like I said, debating. I want to talk about debating. I'm not going to hold you long. Um, most of these little talks are not going to be more than five, ten minutes at the most. Um, unless it's a big topic um, that I want to speak about. But just want to give you all a couple of jewels, a couple of pieces of wisdom that I've learned over the years. So debating. So the pros and cons of debating, um, especially when you're dealing with beliefs, um, things of that nature, um, people believing in a certain thing and uh, thinking that their way is right. Um, I believe in an ultimate truth. Um, and, you know, the truth is always going to come to light. Um, as they say, the truth is going to set you free um, if you're willing to uh, accept that truth. So the, the pros of debating uh, against somebody about different beliefs or whatever you believe in is, you know, you have the opportunity to express your feelings about um, what you believe in, what you live. Um, it helps you to uh, try to convince a person, you know, that this is how they should do things according to your experience, um, according to um, how you've lived in your life. The cons to it is that, you know, most of the time people are not willing to listen to other ideas. So you have to be ready for that, uh, that lashback on, you know, debating. And I've just come to believe that there's really no need for debating. Um, we've debated, you know, since the beginning of time. And you really don't get any results from it, from what I've seen. Um, the only results that you get is from somebody that's willing to learn. So, you know, in my experience, instead of going up and trying to convince somebody or something, or debating somebody, you know, you actually give a person a, a chance to come to you. So if a person comes to you asking a specific question, uh, you can answer that question and then give your life experience, give some advice to them. And they are already primed. Um, their mind is already open for suggestions and um, life lessons, wisdom, understanding about different things. So if you go about it that way, um, People are willing to listen and they'll uh, be able to hear what you're saying. But if you're debating somebody that already has a, a hard stance on whatever they believe, you're really not going to get anywhere. It's hard enough to change ourselves and change our habits. So to go out there and try to debate somebody or convince somebody or convert somebody, you're just running your head against the wall. So that's that's my thoughts on it. At the end of the day, with this debate, and it calls arguments, you know, at the end of the day, it has no results to it. No, no results to to debate to, to debating. So I just learned just let people come to you. Let people come to you with the different questions. If you have the opportunity to su make some suggestions to them on their questions and also give some additional advice on different things, do it that go about it that way. Um. Also, you know, you um, are able to also listen to them, you know, they may have some life experience. So, you're it's a two way um, street there. You're able to listen to, uh, you know, different things that they've dealt with in life, different advice that they've dealt with and different things that you can give to them. As I said before, giving them advice on different things. But at the end of the day, um, people listen to what you say, but more than that, they listen to and look at how you live. So if you believe that you're living the, the truth, and this is what I believe, I'm, I'm living the truth. Uh, the truth is going to be sustained until the end. The truth is going to last until the end. And everybody's going to know, know that ultimate truth um, at their particular time. People are going to look at your life and they're going to be attracted to you just being honest, you being righteous um, and doing what's right no matter who's around. People are going to be uh, attracted to you. 
And I'm I'm a witness to that, you know, if you're if you're living right. None of us are perfect, but you do the best of your ability. People can tell when you're living to the best of your ability and not saying that you're perfect, but you're doing the best you can with what you have. So that that's my advice to everyone out there. Do the best you can out there. Um, live the truth. Find out what that truth is. There is an ultimate truth. Um, people are coming up with this idea of their particular truth. There, there are objective truths out there that can't that cannot be tra- changed. And um, if you seek and find, if you seek, you can find those things. Um, and talk to older people. I like to talk to older people. I like to talk to younger people too, but I like to talk to older people because they have um, experience, life experience, and things that they've dealt with um, during their life. So keep your head up. Keep striving for knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. Uh, have positive people around you, and the truth will endure to the end. Peace.